am Real Genetic Demon, and this is Stunt Car Racer on the Amstrad CPC. I'm playing this on my 6128, well of course I would be because this is the 128k version. This is actually a slightly expanded version apparently. I'm not entirely sure what that really means, but, but as a fate of engineering, Stunt Car Racing is one of the most impressive um, sort of games you'll see out there. I'm just looking at the keys here, and space, right, is the default keys. Um, I think I'm going to define my keys here. I'm going to 5, I'm going to do up, down, uh, left, right, fire. That works for me. Right, okay. I am on a colour TV, number two. Uh, press fire to continue. So there we are. So this is basically it's it's an interesting game, this one. Um it, it's it's a it's a it's almost a tech demo. I think that's the best way to describe it. They're they're sort of tech demos um and and you, you basically um fly around tracks doing stunts um ra out racing your sort of your your sort of your other people. So I'm in division four at the moment. I've got to do little hump little hump and small ramp. Those are the two divisions and the two two, two levels I've got to go through. I probably will not do very well on this, but I'm just gonna go for it anyway with the racing season uh, but it, yeah so I've got pl pl I'm playing against jumping jack race three of six so there we go let's push the button and just coming back on the screen slowly and can't see anything there we go there's the cut oh god there was the course for a second right okay sorry about that that's just the my, my video thing changing around so um steer to rotate oh I can rotate it I've never done that before so this is kind of a very uh, this is very much a feat of engineering I'll, I'll be honest because here we got our little car I've noticed oh we changed mode as well we've gone, we've gone changed changed dropped mode at the same time here so so we've gone from the high res to the low res so this is our this is our this is our um, stock car it's a drop start or stunt car um, I want to drop start Drop me, drop me. It's not dropping me. There we go. Right, okay. So there's the computer car there. And this is the course itself. Now, it's early 3D, this. It's quite impressive for what it is. As we give it a turbo. Get a bit of speed up here. Go around this corner. We'll zoom along. I quite like it, though. I mean, uh, the early days of sort of three-dimensional was... was, was, was I mean, it was it was a rough old time. It was probably like the early days of 2D. I mean, if you think back to the old um, Atari um, uh, at 2600 and its and its graphical sort of limitations and these green blocks representing stuff, yeah, there, there, there was a there was a there was a there was a few things that changed along the way as we went, but but good things happen. Oh God, don't crash, don't smash. Should bounce. Oh God! There's a little crack at the top of the screen. See a little crack along the bar at the top of the screen. That's the damage to the vehicle. So it's slowly, 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 slowly sort of gets more and more damaged as we go along. It's actually quite, actually quite very, very playable. I was quite, I was, I was half expecting this to be uh, uh, particularly slow, but this has been properly created for the, for the Amstrad, and, and we've just made it there, and um, properly created for the Amstrad, and it actually plays really, really smoothly. Um. Much to my surprise, and as I say, because because it is it is um, notoriously slow normally, but I still I quite like this. It's quite the frame rate's pretty good actually. Um, it's, it's not the Amstrad's notoriously slow. This game itself is notoriously slow. Even on the even when you play it on a Commodore Amiga or Atari ST, it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty hard going realistically. Right, okay, let's get some speed up here. Really getting firing up the speed here. Just getting ourselves whizzing round here. Never going to catch Mr. Jumping Jack, but I'm actually quite pleased that we're on the course. That's probably the more important thing. Oh, God. Stay, stay. A little bit of damage to the vehicle again on the top there, on the top, top left-hand corner with that red bar slowly getting damaged. That's like the roll bar. That represents the roll bar in your, your car. And it's sli slowly, 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 slowly. And there's a big jump there. And it's a smoother landing, though. That was a better landing. It did, I don't think it did any damage at all. Um, but that slow, that crack sort of represents the damage to your vehicle. So we're on lap two. Uh, if you see, that's the bottom left-hand corner of the of the display. Lap two. Oh, it's pretty pretty good actually. It's well worth playing. Oh, we just made that little jump there. There's a little gap there. There's a bit more damage to the vehicle, but I think we thought was the wheels scraping as we went over. I don't want to don't want to. Oh, a little bit damage there. 
We have we are we have we have shown this this vehicle what's boss at some very clever and um, sort of graphical uh, ways that it shows that that we're high up here. We're along the top of the level. That's the that's the starting line. We're crossing that. We're on third lap. Way behind the other guy. Nowhere near him. Getting the old uh, pressing the old space bar here for the for the for the thir uh, for, for, our, for our for our thrust, our additional nitrous. Being injected into the engine to, 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 to allow us to, 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 to do it. What a lot of control here. And he's not that far ahead of me. Let's nitrous this over this jump here. I, mean, I think we might overshoot this, but we're going to give it a go. Nitrous it is. Oh, God. I can't even see where we're going. Wow, this is going to be a bounce. It's going to be a bounce. Oh, that was ripped the front of the engine off. But we, we, we've done it. We, we're still here. You have to spend the whole time nitrousing, though. I think that's the problem. Yeah. You kind of you kind of have to just fly around here at, 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 at insane speeds. I am I am literally trying very hard here to, to kind of get around. I think we're on the oh look there's a, a bullet hole on the top of the oh, the the uh, of the dash. I think that's that's I think that's a bad thing. I think that's that's a pit in it that's permanently there from now on. I think that allows it to be damaged further. So it's the top right. There's a little pit there. I have lost the race. I see that, but I am. I the, the, I get bonus points for being better at it though than I was. I've lost the race. There we go. We have lost. Press the fire button. It's now going to change mode. Sorry for this. It's going to flick for a second and do what it does. Oh, we go back straight away. So so um, yes, lap record. You can see the actual um, at the bottom of the corner of the screen. Probably doesn't show you there, but but it definitely chooses the right one. Lap record. Actually, quite impressed myself on that. I usually do really badly. Division four. Um, I have one lap, zero points. Yeah, not doing well here. Humpback versus jump jump jumping jack. All right, let's have a look at the humpback. Oh, it's changing modes again. Sorry. Let's have a little look at this one. Let's go for it. So it's a drop start again on the back of this. Quite like the the, the changing colours and the the, uh, the flips of the modes. It's quite quite nice actually. Quite I'm quite I'm quite surprised. Yeah, the dent has stayed in the top corner of the screen. So the top top right hand corner, that little dot has stayed there. Come on. Then I'm away. Full tilt. I'm blasting off. Yeah, it's not bad at all, is it? Considering... Oh, look at that. It's just whizzed past me. Our vehicles are very triangular. Look at that. It's just in front of me. I can, I can, past him there. I'm in the lead. The green flag's just popped saying I'm in the lead. I'm literally jumping over this. The hump. That's not... Oh, I've lost the lead. He must be beside me. I'm in the lead. He must be he's just, he's just beside me here. And knock him off would be good, wouldn't it? And just, just, just stop him getting at me. This place really well, actually. I'll be honest. This place is a lot better than I... I, I don't know what I was expecting. I've, I've played it before. Um, and I've always thought, I've thought it was quite hard to play. But actually, it's not. It's not bad at all. Well, there he is in front of me. Oh, he's flying along. Look, he's just jumping all over the place. It's crazy. Oh wow, look at his the way his box his car's 3D 3 D'd. I'm pushing pushing him along. Let's see if I can Oh he's he's in my way again. I'm in the lead again. We're just we're we're just insane sort of drivers here. Oh god, oh god. I landed I've landed it. I've not landed it, it's off. We're on the ground. It's all it's all over there. Loads of damage to the vehicle now though at the top 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 left hand corner screen. I'm rather enjoying this one. Not that I shouldn't. You should always enjoy the games playing, but that was kinda that's kinda cool. I felt like I could actually beat him there, but I I am not gonna be able to here. I'm I'm have to turbo through the whole thing just to just to stay in stay in control of the Or at least try and catch up with him. There's the there's the start line. There's the first lap. It's quite a long course actually. It's longer than I thought it was going to be. I'm off. I'm going too fast now. I'm I'm I'm, I'm trying. I'm I'm trying very hard to, to to do the to to do things right, but I'm I'm obviously causing myself more trouble than it's worth. 
All right, I've got to wait for this to swing over the track and come on this crane, and then we push the button and we're go. Yeah, I need to need to need to be here for myself a little bit here. Chuck myself off twice now. That wasn't very good. That's very good actually. Definitely recommend trying this one. Um, it's not one I'd, I've tried before on the Amstrad CPC, but but um, I had played the Spectrum version. I always thought the Spectrum version was too hard. I always thought the Commodore Amiga version was too hard. Um, but this is actually quite fun. If you're into sort of racing car games and sort of that, that early 3D look, which is kind of what this is all about, I kind of like the, the adaption of sort of, um, you know, cheating with a little bit of 2D sort of uh, going on there. I mean, it's all 2D at the end of the day. It's just the way that they've they've put it on the screen. But 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 sort of the cheating with the, the wheels and the car and the vehicle. There's little jumps here, the little, little, little humps. Just over on top of them. It's not good. Not good for the vehicle. There we go, around the edge. But the little sort of cheating with the sort of the engine sticking out and the and the sort of turbos that are there and the other things. It's really quite nice. There we go, down we go. There's some clever stuff going on in this one. A lot of credit to the to the to the developer on this one. Oh, I managed to stay on the road, but I'm doing a lot of damage to the vehicle. I said stay on the road, and I managed to smash it to pieces there with a bit of, bit of ridiculous speed driving. The wheels are spinning. Come on, swing me back over the road. There we go, press the button. Yeah, it's not a bad game at all. Definitely worth it. Definitely worth your time. Definitely worth uh, firing up either an emulator or your actual Amstrad CPC if you've got one. Definitely worth turn, t turning it on. As I say, played it before. Um, mainly the Commodore Amiga. I, my friend was quite obsessed with this one, the Commodore Amiga. And I, I couldn't see it personally. I can see it on the Amstrad, though. I think if I'd had an Amstrad back in the day, because um, I still think of myself as new to the Amstrad, um, if, I'd, if I'd had an Amstrad back in the day, I think I would have been mightily impressed by this. I don't, th don't think it would be so nice on the green screen, though. I think, I think, that, I think, oh yeah, I lost the race. No surprises there, then. Yeah, I lost the race. Press fire! Gonna make me go back to the menu. No! Menu! Track record, little hump. I think the winner, two points. Yeah. I've got a little ramp to do again. I'm not going to continue on because I think we've, we've generally seen the gist of it. And I'll be honest, I'm rubbish. So, so, so it's not worth. It's not worth. I mean, we're playing Roadhog here on the first level again. So, so, so I'm a bit rubbish at it. But, but, but. It's actually quite good fun. I quite enjoyed that one. Anyway, I've been your host, Real Genetic Demon. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye now.